start to the day or it's a late start to the vlog uh, it's about 2 15 now I'm running to go get Sawyer I took off early today because Shannon has a doctor's appointment so Miles did not have school because a water pipe burst in his school or something and, it, and if we went there it would be all over the ground yeah. but I saw my my guidance teacher Miss niece I saw a teacher and Miss, Miss step in at Walmart mm -hmm. and then we just woke Gracie up to be ready Gracie say hello hey. so so we're going to grab Sawyer then we got to go run and do a few things and then we're gonna head out to hockey head out head out to hockey for miles out in Nashville Okay, so I showed you guys in an earlier vlog this, the Mounty Plus 10-1 design. They sent this out for me to take a look at, and what it does is it attaches an iPad to the side of a laptop. So we're going to take a look at this real quick and see how I'm going to use it because, like I mentioned before, I have the app Duet, so I can use this as a second monitor when I'm editing and final cut. Okay, so there's different grips. Different thicknesses. So let's see what we got here. And I'm gonna, it's got on the inside, it shows you which ones, what letter you need for which one. So MacBook, MacBook Pro, I need a D, or F. Let's see what's already in here before I go too crazy. iPad Pro. So B's already set up for my iPad Pro. What do we got on the other side? D. So we're pretty much ready to roll right out the box. iPad Pro 10.5. I guess you can go either way. So if I was going to be looking at Twitter or something like that, I would put it like this but it's also way into the screen. So let's go this way. It still is. I got that on backwards. Angle doesn't look right. Let's try it. Let's flip it around. Okay, there we go. Yeah, this makes more sense because of the angle. Um, let's stick out of the way. The angle, this is this is right. This gives you a, like a contoured look. And it also, the other way, the grips were way into the screen, which didn't make sense. So now you're, you're just a hair into the screen on the MacBook. 
but you're not at all on the iPad Pro. New Rockstars Walking Dead, Episode 7 Breakdown. Okay, finally got a duet up and running. And a cool thing that I don't remember it being on here before when I used it, I don't know if this is with an update or what, but you can actually enable the touch bar functions on the iPad as well, or disable. So that's pretty cool. Um, not to make this a duet commercial, but uh, duet the duet app is pretty powerful. I wish it was wireless, but I think you get better connectivity using the wire, so that's not that huge of a deal. But for what we're here for, for the Mounty Plus, it's been working great. I think I would probably want to move. I like my monitors to be pretty level with each other. It's nice to see the contour design of the iPad Pro and the MacBook Pro. Like the corners are like the exact same radius. Nice attention to detail. So the way that I would use this is with the Mac, uh, Final Cut Pro. And what I'll do is, this was the night before, a couple nights ago, this was uh, the vlog, episode 12. So workspaces, you can open dual displays in window. So now over here, I have all my footage and all my stuff that was taking up space up in this side here. Um, so now everything's over there. I still have, I have touch bar function over there if I want it. Obviously the position I'm in right now recording wouldn't make sense um, to do much from over there. But you can bring the mouse over to this side. You can check your footage, scrub through it. So I can find a clip from over here that I want and grab it and drop it right into the timeline. So like I said, awesome like productivity reason to use the Mountie Plus. And like this thing is so tiny that it could fit in my bag easily. And then if I'm somewhere like at an event or if I'm vlogging later in the day and I want to really like sort of spread out, if I'm at a desk or a coffee shop or whatever, I could easily put the Mountie Plus on, put my iPad Pro on, and then get dual screen function on a laptop. So the other, re the other way that you could use this, so I could take this window here for YouTube, drop it over here, go full screen on the iPad. I still have my touch bar down here. It's like, since my transition, I'll I could scrub through, scrub back. It's my iMessage. It's just something that has the keep of And then over here, be doing, you know, whatever, answering emails, Surfing the internet, maybe get a new window, do something over on this side. The other way that I would maybe use this is, let me open this up, we'll go this way, and say I don't even want to use a duet anymore. We unplug this, and maybe I want to go right into my Twitter feed. So i got my Twitter feed going over here, and then you know, whatever, I'm shopping on Amazon. Super awesome, the Mountie Plus 10-1 Designs. I'll leave a link for it down in the description below. Thanks to them for sending this out. But yeah, I'm really, really liking it. I, it's got a permanent place in my bag after this little demonstration because I can see at least three or four different ways that I would utilize this. And uh, yeah, I'm loving it. That's gonna be it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys tomorrow on the next episode. And if you've yet to subscribe and you just happen upon this, you can do that down below. And if you're enjoying the daily vlogs, hit that thumbs up and let me know. But either way, whether you like it or you don't, I will talk to you tomorrow.